Peter Parker is gonna go for the Battle Fury, or or rather this 2017-ish build with the Mastrum and the Diffusal. I can already see some dispersor plays with the Blade Fury. Oh, it's gonna be so good. So this is gonna be the first game of Invaders Lost Motus still. We are at EPL America Season 9. And this is the grand final, so for Magnus. I'm always telling the same stories. It should be a stalemate. Wow, one sacred. Oh, a stalemate. Yeah, I mean, yeah, mid, but pop out is another completely different story. Sacred falls apart here, got cut down by the. Uh, I guess at the top one as well. Uh, stun hazing out under Mars, and you do have that Blade Fury that still provides magic immunity. One of the few things in the game, so. It's, it's one of our weird uh, scenarios when the, the creeps are gonna be meeting in the river. Mm -hmm. Let's gear up on the high ground, but that spear side and gonna be able to heal him up. You do have the angst while coming in. Michael wants a piece of the sea smile pie, but the right clicks are the only thing that can follow through. And yeah, Magnus has to get out of there. Now you have the ear shakers played and rotating at that love or minute three. Oh, level three here. Sorry, Mark. Oh, the chat is here as well, actually, creating the separation required. Now Slade, he's a lone man up onto this high ground, the skier as well. Pushing him back in, the damage is going to be there. The right clicks from the Chen army. To go for the free on Shafi or four, and additionally, oh, once four. again, Sacred. On the Sacred, the Inkswell will actually connect out onto the Vengeful Spirit. Vench will die. The one last right better things that scales on the hero, as there is that skier underneath that tier one tower. Huh? Can they repeat the same button? Yeah, Slayton is not going to miss this fissure. Oh. It's time to follow as well, but that's a huge wand, and now the bounce is actually, that's enough mana to turn around. Zara wants a little bit more, and Chen has arrived with the army devil. He's going to timber chain out of there. The stun, yeah, that rock is big, it's massive. It's done for a little bit with the root as well. Devil, you cannot die before 10 minutes, my friend. This is going to spell disaster. And what RP pump fake. Okay, alone we see you. But Chen is here as well, and they get the arena. Oh, Under two, skewer forward, they're not even gonna use RP. It's just one team fight after another. Invaders are taking the space and casting the spells just enough to win these engagements. And they didn't use RP for that. And I think it alone is probably gonna look to take that as well. Just gonna farm a little oh, bit. Don't pops the RP. The skewer is level four, so it gets back quite a ways with the Inkswell to follow. That's the follow up damage to the leash as well. Why not? Just a little bit of extra something, I guess, but the right clicks are gonna come through. Yeah, that's a stone thrown and the route to follow. The skewer Another I don't stone? think is available. Wait, they pop the hand of God. They wanna die the skewer too, and they will. Alone gets the double kill. Beneath the fog of war. Mm -hmm. They would love to find Sea Smile. Yeah, he's in the trees and they have that Invis rune on the Magnus popping him forward and yeah, that's a spear back with the arena. He's dead and Saker blinks forward on onto Slade and that's two for nothing. A beautiful smoke rotation from invaders living up to their name and now I'm kind of wondering if you lost more have anything for the pressure. Yeah, they're keeping bottom. The skewer forward as well. They have the shock move. Skewer's gonna miss. Devil continuing forward with the timber chain. But sacred here. He's trying to find that spear angle. Devil, you are gonna get style stop spear whiffs. Inkswell is there, so I don't think that's gonna whiff. But again, the sound's coming through. Do they have the damage? It looks like the right click of silence is there. Sacred gets the one last spear, the impalement of Devil. Put him on the stake. The, the ultimates coming out from e even from the Chan is just a point. It's a thing of beauty, like watching them how they are executing mm. this Chan lineup. This is how you are supposed to be playing Chan, though. Oh, the play forward, yeah, Sacred. He dodges the stun, but he's the uh, thing. Okay, you're a little bit caught out now. No, but the hand of God is going to turn around. RP out onto one. He Parker back is dead. Second. Yeah, Jim Park dies before he can get the Omni Slash off. He was silenced, and now that's another beautiful arena catching both. Slayton, Devil, you're stuck in, and Sacred gets a one huge shield crash to finish it off. Sea Small, you're on the side, but you can only look as there are blinks available. Inkswell forward, that's a skewer back. One more, he is gonna die. And next to Devil trying to deal the damage, but a one, he walks up onto the high ground. They pop the exorcism, they want to continue forward. Sea Small, he is hasted. Alone, you might end up dying for this. He goes into the middle of the group wave. He wants to get denied, but no, it will not happen. And now this pesky Chen. Well, have his life spared a little bit longer. The Inkswell out on him for the movement speed, but Sea Smile, he is hasted. 
with this exorcism, or maybe not a haste, but it is going to be the Timber Chain coming forward, willing death. Ends up cleaning out that kill. The spear forward will actually get Devil clipped out onto that tree. And with the, the exorcism, Sea Spell is going to take this bottom tower. And finally, Lost Modus get two kills. It's, uh, this middle tower going to get taken out very slowly. Medusa not really known to be the best tower hitter, but... You know, you do have the Diffusal Blade finish up with the Manta style. The mana issues actually are going to be quite significant on the side of the Dire. Oh, RP used on to see smile. How many times have we seen this play? This game as he will get taken out alone. Is the kill death ratio off for these teams? Oh, spear. Uh, yeah, the arena forward, the blink forward. Can he get the spear out? Yes, he can. And that's four heroes surrounding you, Devil. You are going to be taken dead, down, kicked, slapped, shot. <laughs> Even magic missiled from whatever the heck Chen does. A gym park actually on the flashing Magnus. He gets the kill on alone. The respect is not there, and now that with the two TP sacred coming forward, he I does have the blink anger available. He wants to use it, but no, he's gonna stun up Slade and Gym Park you're recognizing he is actually not the target. The right click's coming through though. He is uh, quite tanky or doing quite a bit of damage and with that vision coming from the wave of terror. He gets the double kill and spin TPs out of there, sacred. It, I mean, he's got that bottled up haste, and he's gonna look for an angle. He does also have the RP available if he wants to use it, but again, trying to keep vision for his team, pops the haste, and stutter stepping forward, though. He's, he's devil. I don't think that's the target that he wants. It will be the target that he grabs, though. Spear back with the RP, the spear as well. Oh my gosh, devil, you just got to take oh him downtown to another place, but the swap save with the shield is there. Devil, he's gonna heal up with the help, but now you have, of course, Kotara has arrived. Gun Park, he dies for this transgression as well. Devil, he will probably be next on the top block because that spear does end up connecting. He is gonna die here. That's a three for nothing. Invaders just went forward completely undeterred by any kind of, yeah, I mean, they're, they're definitely smoked up and are gonna look for this angle. The TP, if they do it now, might give this away. You know Slayton's looking for this to ping out. Is there. They pop exorcism. He's gonna blink oh in an echo slam. Yes, he does. So they get the rush on the spear forward on the side. But it's not just the ages. He does think it, but see small, you left all alone in the middle of everybody. The park has arrived. He spins the hand of God, mitigating a lot of the damage, and you have devil coming in as well. Gem Park. He really needs to deal with Omni, but he cannot. He gets speared the moment that spin ends, and devil. You are the last man to stand after this incredible imposter of a play that you tried to make on Lost Modus. You just snatched the ages, but you lost another three again. I don't think that's worth it, but you have to try anything and everything you can. He's looking for these skills as Parker. He's even that scared that he's gonna be committing the Blade Fury. Can they get a kill? Yeah, this is a. Oh, the swap is gonna be there. And they will use the RP on him as well. The leash in the background, so he's probably can't even get out of there if he wanted to. But of course, the Vengeful Spirit swap is going to lead to a death. And they're going to go up onto this high ground. Invaders don't even want the tier 2 top. They just want whatever they can get. And Steve Smile calls GG and disconnects from the game. He's had enough of this tomfoolery. That is going to be it for game 1 as it's 30 to 6. Invaders having a KD of 5 to 1 on their team so far in this first game. That was insane. Well executed Chen lineup.